Welcome to Regional Design Associates. Our goal is to help communities make sustainable land use choices that keep them economically, environmentally, and socially vibrant in a changing world. I'm Kurt Fredericks, president and founder of RDA, and I'd like to welcome you to this internship. Our employees use the latest technology to bring cutting edge urban and regional plans to life as quickly as possible. From initial site assessments to the final plan, we work with our clients every step of the way to ensure their specific needs are met. We also work hard to make sure our designs are friendly to the environment. The design process usually begins with an RFP, or Request for Proposals. It is how companies and governments get designs from multiple companies in order to choose the best one. Once we have received an RFP, the first step is to conduct a site assessment. This usually involves a site visit. During the site visit, our researchers talk to community groups to determine what they see as most important and what aspects of the site, like historical buildings or unique animal habitats, we need to know about. This information is compiled and delivered to our planning team so they can get started on planning. After the site assessment, our urban planners compose preference surveys, which are potential plans for residents to review. Getting community feedback on these preference surveys is a vital part of developing a good urban plan. After we've heard back from the people who live in the neighborhood, our planners put together a stakeholder assessment documenting how people felt about the plan and how much change they want for their community. Our planners share this information to design the best possible way to meet these needs. Finally, our planners put together their recommendations into a final plan and proposal, which we submit as a response to the RFP. If our client agrees that our plan best fits the needs of the community, we win the contract. So how do we do all this? As I mentioned earlier, we use the best technology available as a vital part of our planning process. Using WorkPro, we can use email to communicate with the office and instant chat to communicate within Teams. Throughout the course of the internship, you will be creating and submitting various products for your supervisor's approval using WorkPro's built-in notebook features. If anything is missing or incomplete, your supervisor will notify you as soon as possible with feedback and a request. If you need help, use chat to talk to your planning consultant or your planning team. Perhaps our most important tool is iPlan. iPlan allows our urban planners to select and change a district's zoning codes. A complex algorithm then displays how the changes affect the factors of the site that stakeholders care about. When in doubt, check your resources for more information. There are plenty of documents that can help if you're not sure where to begin or if you need help using a planning tool. These resources are updated often, so be sure to check frequently for any changes. Remember to learn and have fun. I've loved urban planning since my first internship 20 years ago, and I hope you get as much out of this opportunity as I did. We look forward to working with you.